There are many endemics in Australia, that is, they do not live anywhere else but this country, and an amazing animal called the wombat is a bright representative of the endemics of Australia. This good-natured cute animal is a very revered animal in Australia and is protected by local law, there is even a national holiday, Wombat Day, celebrated on October 22nd, people wear wombat t-shirts, bake cookies and visit zoos and reserves. And indeed, it is impossible to remain indifferent looking at this funny touching animal, outwardly it resembles a mixture of a huge hamster with a small bear cub, this fact itself no longer allows you to hold back a smile. Wombats belong to the family of marsupial mammals. It is a burrowing herbivore. The body is dense with thick hair, the paws are short, but very powerful, having five fingers each with long claws adapted for digging. The jaws and teeth of wombats are similar to rodents. In the upper and lower rows, wombats have a pair of front cutting teeth. Its weight can reach 35 kilograms, and its body length ranges from 70 to 130 centimeters. Wombats have keen hearing and sense of smell, but rather poor eyesight. Despite the outward clumsiness, they are very fast, escaping from danger, the wombat can easily climb a tree, dive into a pond or run away. They can run at speeds up to 40 km per hour, and in short distances they reach speeds of 60 km per hour, which is a striking figure, because this is much faster than the fastest person can run. Wombats live in the southern and eastern part of Australia, they choose the area for life with soil suitable for digging holes. Wombats use their sharp claws to dig habitable caves in the ground, which sometimes form complex tunnel systems. Typically, most of these systems are about 20 meters long and 3. 5 meters deep. If the sites of individual individuals intersect, caves can be used by different individuals at different times, Wombats are not jealous of their housing in relation to other animals and do not mind sharing their underground passages. Wombats are active at night when they come out in search of food. During the day they rest in their shelters. The adult wombat has almost no natural enemies. One of the few enemies is the dingo dog brought to Australia by man and the Tasmanian or Tasmanian devils. But even these, one of the most formidable predators of Australia, often cannot do anything against the cunning tactics of a brave animal. The fact is that wombats have a unique feature of the structure of their body, which helps them survive and remain unharmed when attacked by predators. The back of the wombat's body is extremely hard due to thick skin, cartilage and bones, something like a kind of shield that the predator will not be able to bite through. In case of danger, the wombat turns its back to its enemy, letting itself be bitten without risking anything. But the main task of the wombat, in the event of a predator attacking him, is to run to his hole and close the entrance to the hole with himself, in this case, discouraged predators have no chance to defeat him, and if the enemy is in the hole, he risks being crushed by wall, the wombat presses it with its back point against the wall and with powerful clawed paws, resting on the ground, crushes the enemy until he simply dies. People have repeatedly observed dead dogs near wombat burrows. Wombats feed on young shoots and grass. Sometimes plant roots, mosses, mushrooms and berries are also eaten. The metabolism of wombats is very slow and efficient, one dense nightly dinner can last for 14 days. In addition, wombats are the most economical consumers of water of all mammals after the camel. They only need 22 milliliters of water per kg of body weight per day. Even animals as well adapted to the conditions of life in Australia as representatives of the kangaroo family spend four times more water than wombats. Puberty occurs in wombats at two years, and the reproductive period almost does not depend on the season. Only in particularly arid regions does the mating season in animals take on a seasonal form. A newly born cub makes its first journey through the mother's body, trying to get into the bag. Here he finds two nipples with milk and peacefully spends the next six months. After the baby leaves the mother's bag, he stays near her for about a year, receiving the necessary protection and care. Despite their fighting qualities, wombats have a good-natured disposition. Tamed animals love affection and stroking. Wombats are well tamed by humans. Their quick wit, good nature and docile nature make these animals the pets of many Australian families. Wombats can often be found in the national parks around Melbourne or in the reserves of the eastern part of the mainland. Despite the protection of these animals by humans, their numbers are still declining, 
due to a decrease in habitat as a result of human intervention in the wild. The life expectancy of these animals is about 20 years.